all right what's popping guys i'm back with another video i just wanted to stop in to show you guys my nail haul from my local nail supply store i live in tampa florida and um i got these from la nail supply um and these are just a couple of things that i picked up these really really cute 3d uh, heart charms or i'm sorry crystals that i'm gonna add to a set that i'm getting ready to do here are some more ab crystals um, in pink and then some i can't re remember the name of this shape but um, these are also some 3d nail art that i'm going to add to my set i also picked up some dried flowers these were five dollars um, this nail supply store has like any and everything that you could possibly need so if you're in the Tampa area, definitely check them out. Um, then I picked up a number two nail art brush. This was $3. And I love their acrylic brushes. I have several of them in different sizes. This one is a size uh, 10. The Sophia Kalinsky brush. Um, I absolutely love this one. I think the ones I've purchased in the past were like a 14, a 12, and I believe at one point I purchased a size 8 from them, but I absolutely love these. I also picked up a 3D uh, gel brush that I'm going to use to practice on acrylic flowers um, here in the near future. This was $4, not too bad and i picked up these nail tips and let me just tell you um, i've used these already and these are my absolute favorite tips so far that i've purchased um, these are coffin shape it really helps to cut down on your filing time i had to do very minimal work with the filing and i absolutely love these you get 500 tips for 15 dollars I picked up a second set of nail tips and these are clear stiletto tips um, in size long. These were only $7 and I kind of want to give these a go. These are full coverage tips, but um, I'd like to use them as just like regular tips. And I also want to start playing around with possibly doing um, some press on sets. So these would be good for that. Um, and they're pretty long. But this also helps to cut down on filing time as well. Um, and I'm just showing you that you can use them either as full coverage or just regular tips here. I apologize for going out of focus there, but I'm just playing around with them, trying to show you the length of them. Um, if you like to wear your nails long, then you do not have to cut them. If you want to create um ballerina or coffin tips then you can just clip the ends i also purchased this cuticle oil for 275 and this is my absolute favorite cuticle oil because it smells absolutely amazing now this is something new for me i saw this there activator spray um, and i asked a gentleman what it was good for and he said everything basically if you want to dry gels acrylic so on and so forth just spritz a little bit on your nails and it should help i picked up this lift free primer um, it says low odor but honey this stuff smells so bad it smells so so bad but it works um, i've used it and i have not had any issues with lifting so I want to say that it works it just smells horrible and it definitely is not low odor i needed a new um, dish for my acrylic liquid so i went ahead and purchased this i've purchased these in the past um and my two-year-old just he touches my stuff all the time and i can't even tell you where the other one is but i went ahead and grabbed another one that was only two dollars I love the KDS glue. Those of you who do nails or if you do your nails at home, you know the KDS glue is nothing to play with. I also picked up some um, nail files, 100 grit and um, are the red ones and then the black ones were 80, 80 grit. So I needed those for shaping. So I went ahead and picked up a couple of those. These were only like 75 cents if I'm not mistaken. Um, and they are very, very sturdy. I needed um, more acetone, so I picked up this uh, 16 ounce for $4. This is 100% acetone. It works great. I love it. 
I also bought some 99% alcohol. Uh, I use this for uh, almost everything. I use this as a dehydrator and also as a slip solution when I'm doing poly gel sets and it works the same. Um, now I did not get these from LA Nail Supply but I did pick these up from my local Michaels and I just thought they were absolutely beautiful. So I went ahead and grabbed those. Those were not on sale. I think those were like $9.99. But they were cute, so I picked them up. I also got these white uh, sanding bands. These are 180 grit. I did not have any. The only ones I had were the extra coarse, so I picked those up. And that is all for my nail haul. If you're in the Tampa area, you can visit LA Nail Supply. But thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.